Okay, so just to show you where I'm at in the project, I've got everything wired in. Uh, I had to find, get creative and find places for all the different boxes and extend out some, some uh, wiring harnesses. Uh, I got just a couple more wires to solder in. Um, and that brings me to the neutral safety switch. So I'm going to go to the other side of the car and I'll show you what, uh, how this is going to work or how I think it's going to work. Okay, so I've already gotten some of the plastic out of the way. Uh, what I am going to do, you can see there's some black uh, grease on there or something. So you can see that when the shifter is in neutral, that rod is only in one place. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to get a shaft collar and put it on that rod. And uh, I'm going to show you how it's going to work from there. We're going to make a little bracket and I've got a little proximity switch that's going to sense when it's in neutral. So I will show you that here in a second day. All right, so the way this is going to work is I got this little shaft collar that's going to go on the shift linkage there. And then this little guy is going to hang out. This is a prox, a uh, inductive pickup sensor. So it's an NPN uh, transistor that picks up this little guy through magic, I assume. I'm not really sure. Uh, and we'll... Uh, It'll pick this guy up only when it's in the neutral position. I'll kind of show you how it works once I once I get there. Um, I've done this before. This is how I set it up in my Honda. Very similar anyway. Very similar type of setup. I think this one's going to work a little better. Um, but uh, yeah, let me get uh, get some power for this guy, and we'll kind of see how she's going to work. So I believe, and I'm just guessing here, that... Blue is probably hot, and black is probably ground. Let's see here. No. Brown is probably hot. There we go. Okay, so this guy's working. And then the signal should be... We'll see here. Let me get another set of probes. Okay, so let's pull in a uh, signal across. Should be enough to trip the uh, trip the. Uh, trip the remote starter there. And it's pretty much got to be, got to be pretty close there to trip it. Cool. So it's unlikely that I'm going to get a false positive off of this. All right. So we said brown was hot, black is ground, blue is signal. All right, so I'm going to wire it in. Uh, and uh, I'll kind of show you how it works before I finalize the install. At least, uh, kind of, sort of, anyway. So, talk to you in a few. Okay, so I totally forgot to film the final installation here. But, uh, just, this is the inspection camera. I got it snaked down in the shifter there. Let's see if you can see it. There we go. Uh, so, this... See what I can point here. This is the rod. There's the little, uh... The little uh, collar, shaft collar, and then the sensor's here, and you can see the red LED. And when I move the shifter, you can see it takes that little shaft collar forward and back away from the, uh, the shifter there. So, sorry for the crappy film of uh, a screen filming a screen, but uh, like I said, I, uh, I just completely forgot to, to film it for you when it was, uh, when it was out. But... Uh, yeah, there you go. That's how uh, how it works. Thanks for watching.